early on, Cali Condors have a chance to rack up some big points, or will it be LA or London may snatch away those opportunities? Well, Gastadella was 26-2 when she went 55-9 a couple years ago. She's faster than that, boy. She's hurting right now. And there goes Dahlia. Dahlia trying to get her second win of the season. And... Oh! No! Gastadella got her at the end. She gets the jackpot. Barrel Gastadella getting the win. Oh, wow. The last stroke. Literally, the last stroke. What happened? to Beryl Gastadello, the last three strokes. I think that Gastadello has found a home in the Hunter Butterfly. Real long for Caleb Dressel. Does that cost him some momentum coming Look off the wall? Look at Shields coming down. Shields staying down. Can Shields edge out Dressel? No. no! Caleb Dressel gets the win for the Cali Condors. Beryl Gastadello upsetting the Cali Condors with the win in the women's 100 butterfly, but Caleb Dressel answers right back. He wins the men's 100 butterfly, fifth win for him in the 100 fly. But how about Bita Nelson? She's gonna lead the way. Jackpot time, by the way, 4.8 seconds. This could be a jackpot. One, two, Bita Nelson, her third win in the backstroke. And she will get a small jackpot, but again with that one-two finish. Bita Nelson getting it done in the 200 backstroke. And what was once tied, now a little lead. Murphy came home at 27-4, and so did Kaveki. So Murphy still has a lot left in the tank, I believe depending on the training. He's still in first, but not by much. Oh, back and forth they go. The battle between LA and Cali continues, and this win is gonna go to Murphy. He does it, only though by about two tenths ahead of Kaveki. But that's what makes Ryan Murphy jackpot master, hauling in a big, load for L.A. Curran, who have moved into the lead. Look at this, Annie Laser has taken the lead, but King keeps turning. She somehow has found her way to get their hand on the wall first against Atkinson, but she's trailing here. Oh, Laser trying to get it done for London. Can Laser do it? Finally take down the champ. King's not gonna go down easily, though. Annie Laser, she does it. King defeated London Roaring. Oh, Annie Laser snaps the streak. King is no longer on top. What a streak it was, though. What? An incredible streak it was for Lily King. It really comes down to this last 50 and really who's got the most left after a hard week of training. You see LeCole right there, one of the most brilliant careers in history at Texas, so he's used to being in this situation. And LeCole looks pretty good trying to get LA, but they're still flipping back and forth. It's a matter of who touches first. It's LeCole and LA, they get the win. And how about the current? They go first and third. Have we had some great races today? I mean, I, I, mean, I have to go back and look, but almost every race we've had has literally hundreds of a second. This is the same, nine one hundredths of a second. And they basically went stroke for stroke the entire way. They turn even. 25 meters to go. Who wants it more? Great turn there by Hines. Hines comes out stroke for stroke. Natalie Hines trying to hold on to the lead. Will it be Kelly or London? No, no London. London. London does it, but only by four one hundredths of a second. What in the world are we seeing today? If this is any indication about what we're gonna see next week, I can't wait. How about this start? Lots of great racing. And if you like the LA Current,
They're the ones that are on top early on. Zabo looks really good on the top in lane number eight. We'll see Zabo go for the world record tomorrow in the fly, but out of the turn, it looks like Dressel, and it is going to be Dressel. He wins it for the sixth time, and oh, what a jackpot! Coming the way to Caleb Dressel, rocking in the points, 19 points. Man, oh man, Caleb Dressel, He's got 29 of the 111 points Callie has here on day number one. And with that win, Callie has moved in front of LA, now leading by five points. Weitzel turning just in front of Schmoliga headed home. Schmoliga, remember, had that great lead off in the free relay. Oh, Abby Weitzel, she is going to do it. And LA one, two, jackpot again! Oh, look at the smile for Abby White till as she hauls in 15 more. Guess a warm up with 100 free any day of the week. American record for Weitzel and the current. They're back on top. Turning first, ahead of Vizayos and Seliscar. Nine points on the line for the win. Here comes Vizayos. And Lanza moving up as well. And Vizayos. Lanza! Oh, Lanza at the end. How oh, he came charging. Yeah, that'll help out London. Yeah, that'll help their cause out tremendously. 16 points added to the total for the London Roar. LA remains on top. London trying to get back some of those points they lost early on. Look at Peter Look at Nelson the turn. off the wall. Look at the turn! Peter Nelson is gonna pop out in front, battling with Pickram for the 200 IM. Not only can she win the 100, but Peter Nelson takes the 200 as well. Ah, Cali indeed using the jackpot to their advantage. And ever so slight is the lead for LA Current, up by seven points. Martin Nagy battling against Silva. He's in the yellow cap on the left side. And <laughs> this is going to go to Martin Nagy. First and third for Aqua. It is the first win of match. 10 for the Aqua Centurions. Calling in 21 points. LA's lead, 10 points. A lot of swimmers off to a quick start. Including Hannes, who gave King a run for her money the last time as well in the Hunter breaststroke. But nice pull out for Ali Atkinson. Hannes and King back and forth. Hannes is going for it, and the streak is over in the 50 as well. Molly Hannes gets the win, but for the team, the Condors soaring to a 1-2 finish. Big turn for L.A. Anastasia Gorbenko disqualified, so L.A. loses two points, and that puts Cali into the lead. Philip Hines trying to hold on. Can he hold off Caleb Dressel? Looks pretty tight. Dressel's coming, charging home. Dressel, this is going to go down to the touch as well. And it goes and it the way to Cali. Big time finish for Dressel and 24 points for Cali. Now in the lead with 191 points. Right there in the middle. You, you can't take your eyes off of him because 
Here they go. One one hundredth of a second. What a great turn there by Smoliga. Oh, Smoliga. She is going to do it with that turn. Another win for the Condors. Smoliga's on top. And again, how big is that? Because she's won the jackpot. Huge. Huge jackpot win there. And, and what a big turnaround. Man, the Condors are surging late here on day number one. Now, oh, folks, this is tight, but give the early lead to Guido, who turns first. Guido just has so much easy early speed. Guido and Murphy. This one is going to be tight. Is it going to be Murphy? It does. It is. Murphy, jackpot master again. L.A. needed that. Not by much, but good enough for the big win. L.A. trying to climb back in. But the Condors, they're on top. But Flickiter's coming back. She's not going to give it to her. Yeah, Flickiter and Dumont. Cali Condors. Flickiter answers back after Dumont tries to take it over. And Flickiter leads a 1 3 finish for the Cali Condors. And a big difference between our top two teams 18 points for Cali. Only three points for LA, so the lead is now 47. Looks pretty good. Top team, James Guy, trying here, to battle with Here they come. Line. They're trying to battle back. You look at Dean and Guy, but they're not going to do it. This is what this is sort of a running pattern all year long. Romanchuk and Sheffer hangs on to get second. And it's going to be Tom Dean, third for London. Gets the win for the Aqua Centurions in match 10. But it remains Cali and the Condors on top headed to the medley relay to pick the skins. And this is great for Cali. So they've got a couple choices to choose from. They've got the breaststroke. Do you go with Lily King, who got upset today? Or do you go with Smoliga, who smashed the field today in the 50 backstroke? I almost would go with Smoliga. Got the hot hand. They got time to decide as Cali wins the relay. They will pick the skins. London second and LA third. That'll be fun to see these relay teams match up with energy standard. He'll have everybody right in sight, including Moresi at the end, who has been 45-7 on a relay, but he's not gonna catch him. And Rudy was .13, they were perfect on their starts. LA picks the skins, they win the relay, and how about Aqua? Aqua second, London third. Well, it's Ryan Murphy in the lead in the MVP picture, just uh, two and a half points in front of Caleb Dressel of the uh, Smoliga third. And in the match, Cali Condor is trying to remain unbeaten ahead of LA by 47 points.